We even got a pull through. I didn't even know it was a pull through. It's pretty short. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully we can fit in the pull through. Good job, Mikey. You've got first, us here. First time at Houston Woods and we got a pull through full hookup. And I booked it one day ago, last night. <laughs> Not six months ago. We are really on level here though for it being a full hookup pull through. You'd think they'd make these sites a little more level, but we're actually more level at the other park over in Kentucky. What do you think, guy? Say it'd be another park, or do you miss Piper? I miss Piper. 19,000 miles, almost to that 20K mark. Oh my gosh, <laughs> what do you want? This is uh, foreign territory. Yeah, you don't even do this in, at home. Uh, it's been a long time since I've had to do this. Do you know what you're doing? Put the clothes in this one and turn the knobs till it starts. You gotta put soap in and stuff too. Oh yeah, that part. <laughs> yep, just take one and toss it in. I try to make it as easy as possible to encourage you. <laughs> now I turn it on. Okay. Warm. It's currently on number five, which is a mixed load for 30 minutes. That's good, right? That just... should be good, yeah. It's nice having full hookup. Yes. Now we get to do laundry and not have to worry about it. We got site A9 over here at Houston Woods. We're gearing up to explore the park a little bit with these bad boys. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. There's a lot here. It's a big park, but I don't think we're going to do real anything. Yeah, we'll find out. ourselves a map yep okay cool yep that's a map sweet since we've never been to this one no yet <laughs> these not electric they're actually pretty scenic I think they look pretty cool Chop, chop, Mikey. That laundry's done. Yep. Try to put it in the dryer. Dryer sheet in. Sure. As long as you want. Did you earn yourself some champagne after that bike ride? I earned it after the laundry. Oh. Yeah, that's why we waited till later in the day to do this. At least it's shaded. Yeah, Pretty nice trail. Really nice day though. You know, I was worried about us coming here because it doesn't look like it's rained here in a, quite some time. We might have a torrential downpour any day now.
all I need for him to fall down that. Huh. Yeah, that's kind of different. Yeah. Very cool, like rock formations. Some dinner for Mike enjoying a beverage doesn't really get much better than this how's your din dins amazing good as always dinner by the fire doesn't get any more romantic than that <laughs> not for you guys what do you say Mikey Get on out of here and we go get Piper. Yeah. I suppose. <laughs> I'm excited. What about you guys? Want to go get Pipey? Yay! The time has come. I am here at Glass City Canine in Toledo to pick up my Piper. Uh, Mike is at work, so he was unable to be here. So I will be videotaping when I bring her home. I may actually surprise him and take her to see him at work. So if you think I should take Piper to go see Mike at work instead of surprising at home, leave this video a thumbs up. Boop that thumbs up, everyone. All right, I'm so excited. Can we just see her? Ooh. And I'm pretty sure that she knows you're here because as soon as I went back there, she was like sniffing all over my arms like she could smell you on me. Look who we got here. We got a pipey back. Yay! She was so excited to see me, but now she's like, let's get out of here. I got my girl back. She's uh, way excited and I got a little training myself and it's gonna be a lot of homework, but I'm excited. I am dedicated. I want Piper to be the best dog she can be with the most structure and happiness that we can all have together. So hopefully this is the first step of a long, happy road of training for a little miss pipe back there. Who did that? Who is that? A pipey home? Pipey's home. Guys like, I thought you were dead. <laughs> She's back, guy. She back. You need training. Someone is awfully happy to be home. 
That's that's guy breathing heavy. You're gonna be next. <laughs> Oh gosh, your toys. Oh yeah, so many toys. As you can see, Piper loves to kill the toys. We've had Piper back now for a couple of days and she's finally like decompressed. Uh, that whole first day when we got her back, she was just so tired and so sweet. Oh, she was just so happy to be back home and I think the training was good training for her. She needed us to not be there. She needed some outside source to ingrain these things into her little brain of stubbornness. And I've been working with her every day after that, and it's been going well. We still have upcoming, upcoming training sessions with the trainers out in the public, at our house, at a campground, on a hiking trail, at a Lowe's store, at a park, all those things upcoming so we will keep everyone updated as to how she's doing. As for now I think we're gonna pack this baby up and get back on the road because we got some more camping to do yet so until next time see ya!